Hello and welcome to Soda Tasting, an online show dedicated to soda reviews and appreciation. I'm Patrick O'Keefe. On this episode of Soda Tasting, I am going to be reviewing Jones Root Beer from Jones Soda Company. Give you a look at the box there. On one side I've got some people being hit with a puddle from a car that is passing by and a kid in a mailbox. Each bottle has a different uh, image on it. Here, I'll give you a look at this one. So, let's see. Jones Soda Company, Jones Flavor Root Beer, Natural Flavors, Products of Canada, Bottle Under the Authority of Jones Soda Company, 1001st Avenue South, Suite 100, Seattle, Washington, 98134, jonesoda.com. If you're like us, you think for yourself, come on, do they really believe we'll fall for flashy ad campaigns that cost more than a solid gold private jet? Don't expect to find any of that here. We let what we do speak for itself. At Jones, we're just regular people who make good soda. While we can't promise you more popularity or better hair, if we like your photo, we'll put it on a bottle. Jones Soda, independent since 1996. Your photo, your soda, your brand. Send us a photo. Send us your photo. If we like it, we will put it on our label. The Jones family, independent since 96. Marketing. So, let's read through the nutritional facts before I open this, actually. 180 calories in 12 ounces, 35 milligrams of sodium, 46 grams of total carbohydrate, 46 of which are sugars. The ingredients are carbonated water, inverted cane sugar, caramel color, natural flavors, sodium benzoate, a preservative, gum acacia, phosphoric acid, calcium disodium EDTA to protect flavor. So, 180 calories, caffeine-free, sweet sweetened with inverted cane sugar. I bought this at Harris Teeter. The inside of the cap says, A merry heart maketh a cheerful con continence. Jones has a smell that is, you know, you definitely pick up like kind of a licorice -y vibe. Maybe it's um, anise. Reminds me almost a little bit of how fennel smells, which is kind of random as a reference. I used to have this fennel toothpaste from, um, uh, what is it? Uh, it's company, and I, you know, I had kind of a, you know, a smell that maybe reminded me of this a little bit. Not a lot. More likely it's the licorice type of vibe. But mostly it just smells like a root, you expect a root beer to smell. A kind of sweet smell. So let's go to taste. Jones root beer is pretty good. It's it's a mild flavored, smooth, sweet root beer. It's not a root beer that has a lot of spiciness to it, or you know where you pick out all these different herbs and vegetables and minerals and nutrients. Um, but it is a like I said, a mild flavored, sweet, smooth root beer. <clears throat> what I would say though is that um, it is a little too sweet for me almost. I don't know, the sweetness just seems really, really powerful. And I think it's too sweet. Like, the sweetness is lingering. It's not an offensive sweetness. It's not like it's... It's not like a diet sweetener aftertaste. It's just so much sweetness. It's just so much sweet. So, that might sound very good to you. Uh, if so, excellent. I could definitely see how some people really like this. Me, personally, again, that overpowering sweetness takes away from what is an otherwise pretty good root beer flavor. I think my rating is going to be 3 out of 5. Are you a fan of Jones Root Beer? If so, please let me know in the comments on YouTube or on SodaTasting.com. Please subscribe to Soda Tasting via YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, RSS, or email. You can find all of those options at SodaTasting.com. Thank you for watching, and as always, everything in moderation.